Have you ever looked at the temperature on your weather network app and thought, it feels way hotter than this says? Well, you're not imagining it. That's where humidity is to blame. Humidity is the amount of water vapor in the air. The more water vapor, the higher the humidity. And higher humidity makes the air feel wetter. On dry days, your sweat evaporates and that cools you off. But when it's humid, your sweat just sits there. No evaporation means no cooling, which leaves you feeling like you're sitting in a steam room. That's why Canada uses something called Humidex. This is a number that combines the temperature and the percentage of humidity, a value you might have noticed in your forecast, to reflect how hot it actually feels on your skin. So a day that's 30 degrees on the thermometer might feel more like 40 when you factor in the humidity. And anything over 40? That's when things start to feel really uncomfortable and even dangerous with prolonged exposure. And in cities, it can feel even worse. Concrete, asphalt, and buildings soak up the sun's heat and trap it, creating what's called an urban heat island. That extra warmth combined with humidity can push the feels like even higher than in nearby rural areas. And different parts of Canada can bear the brunt of humidity more than others. For example, from Ontario towards the east, this region can tap into Gulf moisture, which pushes Humidex values higher than arid regions in the west. So the next time your forecast says that it's 25 degrees outside, but you feel like you're melting, it's not just your imagination. It's not the heat. But it's not just the heat. It's not the heat. Because it's not just the heat. It's, it's the, the humidity. humidity.